Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I give you Senator Rand Paul. This is Art Kahn in Virginia Beach. The Republican senator from Kentucky first became a supporter of Ken Cuccinelli when he challenged the Affordable Care Act in court. I think in Ken Cuccinelli you have a candidate who believes in justice, who will defend the Bill of Rights, when the government gets it wrong. But right now, Ken Cuccinelli is fighting for his political life in his bid to become governor of Virginia. His Democratic opponent, Terry McAuliffe, enjoys at least a seven-point lead in the polls. I heard that Terry McAuliffe's been raising a lot of money, most of it not in Virginia. I heard that the, no, the most common zip code is 90210. Anybody know where that is? So Hollywood liberals, Beverly Hills, think they can elect somebody in Virginia. But Cuccinelli and his supporters believe there is still time for a grassroots effort to turn this race around at the polls. Second District GOP Chairman Gary Byler is one of them. Oh, absolutely. We're within striking distance. I need these folks here to talk to others. Truth is our friend. The more people know about me, my record, and my plans versus Terry, his record, and his lack of plans, the better we do. But right now, Cuccinelli is not doing well with women voters in Virginia. The, the abortion issue is one, no doubt, that has been a drag on the ticket in the general population, and that's because the other side are using scare tactics. You have not heard uh, Cuccinelli's campaign or our ticket talk about the issue at all because, quite frankly, the law is settled, and that is not any part of our platform to be passing any new laws. Well, I did get both the Attorney General Cuccinelli and Senator Paul to talk about their position on abortion and why they say that position is being distorted and falsely portrayed by the McAuliffe campaign. I'll share that conversation with you tonight at 6. Live from the newsroom, I'm Art Kahn.